Afternoon explosion levels a Stillman Valley home. We first told you about this at five. The blast hurt one person. Just lips and spent some time on the scene. Just people felt this explosion from miles away. Yeah, Eric, I spoke to people that felt the explosion from many streets over. It's a startling disaster, but the fallout could have been much worse. And everyone in our neighborhood felt the vibration and everything. Around 2.40 Friday afternoon, fire crews were called to a home on East High Road in rural Stillman Valley for a house explosion. We had an obvious explosion. Uh, we had some minor fire in the grass in front of the house, but there was no active fire in the house. And the house was, uh, at this time, the house had been leveled by whatever caused the explosion. First responders found one woman inside. She was taken to the hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. Two dogs were also on the property. Both are okay. One was found more than an hour later under the rubble. Neighbors tell me the blast knocked pictures off their walls and some homes were hit with debris, but the sound of the explosion was something they had never heard before. So I was actually at home getting ready for work. It was about 2.40ish and I was in the living room with my sister and we heard a loud like bang and heard vibrations. So I thought like our pipe burst or something or maybe it was our air conditioner. The explosion was heard from a couple of towns from what we're being told. Uh, one of the neighbors called 911 right away along with multiple other people. I wanted to say thanks to all the agencies that helped us out today. Everybody was safe. No fatalities. We're happy with the turnout as far as uh, the people that responded. Yeah, it was insane. Like to see something happen like that in a, such a small town, it's like such an odd case. Just hope everyone's okay. Last we heard the investigation into what the blast was is still underway. We'll update you on mystateline.com. Eric.